Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Crazy D's Equipments. Today we're going to talk about our spring equipment sale. All right, guys. So the first piece of equipment we're going to start to, we're going to talk about is this uh, ten wheel rake. Uh, it is an H and S. It's in really good condition. It's in. Uh, it does need a tire aired back up from sitting here all winter long. But um, this piece is on consignment. Uh, we are asking two thousand for it. It's got good hoses. Good long. It's got the one good hose in line and a good cylinder with it. So if you guys are getting into hay and season here soon and looking for something like this we definitely got one so guys before we go any further um, if you guys are interested in anything that you see in this video that's on the lot um, you can contact me at crazy D's equipment at gmail uh, just shoot us an email and I will get back with you and we can get something worked out uh, on payment and pickup and stuff I know a lot of you guys are out of state and stuff but it requires a little bit of extra work to come and get this kind of come pick up whatever you're wanting to purchase but uh, again that's crazy D equipment at gmail the dock will put one of those uh, things underneath and we'll try to keep put it a couple times in the video so you guys know what you got what what you need to do to be able to contact us but anyways let's talk about the next piece of equipment so guys we're going to talk about the john deere disc next this is uh, a 14 foot john deere disc uh, i have a cylinder that'll go with it you'll need to replace the hoses on that cylinder um, otherwise it the discs are all in good shape the bearings are in good shape the tires are old and weathered but they would do the trick for you out in the field uh, if you purchase this thing we do have an, uh, a forklift we get this loaded on a trailer for you it's going to kind of be uh, it's going to stick out a little bit it's going to be a little bit hard to take it down the road to get it home but if this is something you're interested in i'm asking 850 dollars for this so 850 on the john deere disc all right guys the next thing i got is a 16 foot tandem it's a john deere 210 uh, offset disc uh, it's got a cylinder that comes with it they got good it's got good good hoses on it um, this is a big boy another one that we can get loaded for you but it's going to be a little bit of a pain to haul down the road um, good rubber on each on both of the tires and stuff and we're asking 2500 on this disc so if this is something you're looking for we definitely got let's move on all right guys we got this dirt excavator or dirt mover here um, I'm not for sure the distance on it. I forgot to measure it before we did this. Uh, the weight box is full of concrete, so it's definitely been well weighted for you. It's got a cylinder that comes with it, uh, hoses that might need to be replaced. There's a couple, there's a one bad spot in there, but um, this thing overall is in pretty decent, in really good shape. We're asking 2,500 for this. So if you're needing a dirt, a dirt mover, we definitely got one for you. Let's move on down the line. So guys, this is a six foot full type bush hog, um, hydraulic lift. Uh, it's got decent hoses on it. Doc actually had to repair a hose on it. This thing here was on the back of that DC uh, propane tractor. This is, came with it. This is what they were using. This, this thing has been used just a month ago because they used it to mow the entire farmstead before the auction. So it is a good working mower. Uh, the gearbox is all the blades are good there is a little bit of rot at the front of the deck because people cannot clean the grass off after they get done mowing and they leave it there and water it contains the water and rots out the deck but this is a really good mower uh, if you got a uh, older tractor and you wanted to, to use it as your mowing tractor this would be ideal for, ideal for it we're asking 675 dollars for this thing um, so just let me know if you're interested we can definitely get it loaded for you and, and get it up and ready to go so so guys it's got a country clipper zero zero turn mower it's a z pro uh i forget how big the motor is on it it has just a little over 300 hours on it this actually was the wizards he's moved on to bigger and better things mower wise so um which i mean by that having somebody else mow his grass so the sign of true success is watching someone else mow your grass but um he 
he decided to go ahead and re let this go ahead and sell this thing. So if you're interested in it, we're asking $3,200 from it. And just email me, let me know, and we'll get things set up with you. All right, guys. So the next thing we got going here is this eight foot box blade. Uh, it's in really good shape. Uh, it's got all the uh, teeth for it and stuff for you. Uh, this is going to take a pretty decent sized tractor to operate it. But if this is something you're looking for, we, it's, it's it's now priced at five fifty for you. So it gives you gives you something. You know, if you're going to need a box blade this size. But let's move on down just a bit. So guys, we got this log splitter. Uh, it's in pretty good. It's in really good uh, shape. It is a home homemade built job, but they did a really good job doing it. Um, it's got a little, and I think this is about a ten horse motor, so it could probably use a heavier motor if you're going to do bigger. But this motor runs pretty good. Well, anyhow. I need to learn how to operate the motors, what we need to do there. But um, if you, this is something that you're looking for and you, you, you need to get that firewood worked up for next winter, you can split. So this is on the lot. It's trailer type pulled. So you can just pretty much take this wherever you need to be to operate it. Um, I am asking 650 bucks for this. So uh, again, if it's something that works for you, then just, just go ahead and email me. And then also, if the dog pans over here, I got right there one blade. And then behind me over here, I got one, two more blades. So we have a whole bunch of uh, back blades if you're needing them. Uh, that one there is five foot. This one here is five foot. The far one over there is a Dearborn. This one's a Massey Ferguson. And then behind me, I have a seven foot that's a much lighter built that we've got turned backwards. I showed a customer that it, that it did turn all the way around. Um, on those blades, every single one of them are priced the exact same. So if you're needing a blade, 350 will buy you a blade. Well, let's move on down the road. So guys, I got you covered for mowing season. So here pretty soon it's going to be time. Some of you have probably already started. The ones of, of you that live south of us here in Kansas. Uh, it's, it's, I got you covered for mowing season. We got one, two, three, four. Uh, mowers. I got five foot, a five foot, a five foot, and a four foot. These would be ideal for the back of your eight in, nine in, two in, uh, any tractor that you got three point that you need to do some mowing and they're all priced the exact same. It is 350, 350 a piece for uh, any one of these bush hogs. Some of them are better than, uh, or some of the decks are better than other decks. And, uh, but I think they all do the trick for you. They all got good, good blades, good solid gearboxes, PTO shafts are there. Um, so if that's something you're looking for, one, two, three, four, we got here on the lot and I got some more in the back that, the, that me and the doc need to process and then get up here for, for, uh, for later on. So, but anyways, let's move on down the road. So before we move on here, guys, I just want to remind you, you got to go to, uh, Crazy D's equipment at Gmail. If you want to contact me on any of this, Doc will put a thing down. And then also, real quick, why I got you here. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, this is a good time to do it. We do, there's a, we do a lot of videos on what's on the lot, what's for sale, amongst all the other crazy projects and stuff that we're working on. And uh, if you're not a member of the channel, this might be a time to do it because here pretty soon we will announce the live stream with me and Sis. So that's coming up. But besides the unnecessary business stuff, let's discuss. I got a uh, six foot spring tooth, three point. Uh, this is ideal for you arena people who have the horse arenas and you're practicing your barrel racing and stuff and you need to keep the arena smooth. I got one of these. Uh, it's three hundred. No, it's three hundred dollars for it. Uh, if you want to, if, if this is something that'll work for you, let me know, and then we'll move right over here. All right, guys, I got two pull type 
uh, bush hog mowers. They're both four footers. These would be ideal to put behind that Farmall H or Farmall M or Oliver 60 and stuff. So you could take the old tractor, collect your tractor out and, and do your, do some mowing. You got a John Deere B. These would be perfect size for that. Um, PTO shafts are there. This one, the orange one on this side, I'm asking 250 for it. It's got a decent deck and stuff on it, but the PTO shaft has been repaired at one time, and I just I think that's a good price. Uh, they're both set up to if you do have hydraulics on your tractor, you can put a cylinder on them to raise and lower them. But right now they both have ratchets. Um, this one here is. Uh, much nicer the two but uh this one here if this is something you're looking at this one i'm asking 354 and we got one more piece guys a special piece all right guys i got this little six foot three point disc now these don't last very long at all this just went on the lot yesterday i will guarantee you by the end of this week it'll probably be sold these are super hot in my area i am asking 550 for this thing so if this is something you're interested in as soon as you see this video you better get a hold of me right away because um, like i said they do not last long the bearings are all decent in it everything spins um, there has has been some slight repairs here and I think one other place I noticed but otherwise overall it's a very decent very uh, nice shaped uh, three-point disc so if this is something you're needing to get that garden into the ground I got one for you guys but otherwise guys thank you for coming in thank you for watching and thank you for sticking through and if you haven't subscribed subscribe and uh, I'll see you later on